Nimekuja kukupa nguvu ya kufanikiwa. To give you power to prosper. Sio mbinu tu. Not only strategy. Elimu wengi mmepata. Many you have education. Lakini mtu anaenda kwa mganga. But a person who goes to Anasema nataka niwe tajiri. He says I want to be. Unafikiri anaenda kupata elimu? Do you think they are going to get Anapata elimu ya upande mwingine? They are getting education to the. Kwamba lazima uchukue nyota ya mtu fulani. You must take someone. Ili ufanikiwe. For you to prosper. Ili uwe na cheo. For you to have a title. Nataka nikwambie. I want to tell you. Viongozi duniani. Leaders in the world. Walio na kazi wengi. Who have jobs. Wengi wenye irishi. Most of them. Na wakapata and they were hired Hajapewa, they are not given kwa sababu tu ya elimu yao wameenda kutafuta nguvu kwenye madhabahu zingine na baadhi mbaya sana nguvu walizotumia zinaitwa fake power na baadhi nzuri sana nguvu ninayokupatia leo ni original power original power baada ya kutoka hapa here, hakuna mwenye irichi kiunoni atakupita wewe haitawezekana kupita mwenye irichi haitawezekana kupita na tumia majini bwana amenituma kukuweka juu yao bwana amenituma kukuweka juu yao Sio issue ya elimu tu kuna zaidi ya elimu na ndio inaofanyika hapa elimu ni muhimu education is very important but most they have education lakini maisha wamekuwa zero but they are zero in life issue sio elimu tu the issue is not being education kuna mkono zaidi ya elimu there is a hand more than education that which that hautaupata chuo you won't get it to your hautaupata duniani huko you won't get it to the world utaupata madhabahu ni you will find it to the altar of god na ndio kitu nimekuja kufanya hapo that is what i've come to do na itakuwa leo leo it shall be so today kila mfanyakazi Every employee prepare yourself to increase. Every business person prepare to increase. God have never created you to be an escorter to other people. No. Hakupoteza muda wake. He did not waste his time. Kukutengeneza to create you. Uwepo duniani. For you to be in Eti the maisha yako yanasindikiza wengine. For your life to escort other people. Mungu alipoumba mtu. When God created a man. Bible inasema. The Bible says. Akambariki. He blessed na alipo mbariki, and when he blessed him akamfanya kuwa mtu mkuu he make him a great person mtawala a ruler na yesu and jesus kwa nini alikuja duniani why he came to the world kwa sababu mungu because god alipomfanya mtu when he made a great man ya vitu to be above things sio vitu viwe juu yake no things to be above alipo muumba when he created a man adam na eva adam and eve wakakosea They, were, they, they did something wrong Ndipo pale, there is where man, worth vieo, titles utajiri, riches kuwa juu ya they started to be on top of it they start to be lord upon the wewe na mimi. when you and I created Zile za mungu, the blessings of God is to make you above things Sio vitu viwe juu yako. not things to be above you is to make you lord over things buwana, when we say lord it means a ruler it means the one who controls Leo binadamu today humans wamekuwa chini ya mali wanakuwa chini ya utajiri na utajiri unakukontrol leo nimekuja kusema Yesu alichokuja kukifanya amenituma nikifanya hapa sikiliza listen please sikiliza vizuri sana listen to me very carefully wanadamu alipokosea when a, a, a man uh, did an error Mali. When a man did an error, Mali. and wealth, treasures, Mali. treasures, Vitu. things, kuwa 
juu ya manadamu began to be above men na katika ulimwengu wa roho and in the spiritual wanadamu wengi unaoona most men that you see wamepiga magoti mbele ya mali they are kneeling before treasures na wamenyosha mikono and they are Amen. Say amen. Sema tena amen. Say again amen. Na kwenda piga magoti hapo. Angalia kwenye hii chuma. Kneel down and look at this eye. And raise your hand. Nyosha mikono ya kusalenda sio. Raise your hand as you surrender. Salenda, salenda. Surrender. Sema amen. Say amen. Binadamu wengi leo most men today hata tunaona wanatembea even those who are sick na wengine mko hapa leo and others you are here today na wengine mmekuja leo and others who have come today wamenyosha mikono ya surrendering mbele ya mali before treasures mali and treasures ni bwana kwao is lord to them ni bwana mwingine it is another lord to them anaye wa control who controls them unaposema bwana when you say lord maana yake anaye ku control he means the one who controls anaye kuamlia maisha the one who decides anaye kuambia ili usifanye ili fanya the one who tells you this do na ndio maana hata yesu alipokutana na shetani that's why even when jesus shetani alitaka kumfanyia mchezo huo huo satan want to play him akamwambia nishujudie he said bow to me yesu akamwambia jesus told him wewe sio bwana Mali sio Bwana. Sujudia Mungu pekee. Worship God only. Imeandikwa. It is written. Sasa nisikilize. Now listen. Na wengine mko hapa. And others you are here. Na leo nataka nikuhakishie. And I want to assure you. Kabla hujatoka hapa. Before you leave here. Utakuwa umesimama juu. You stand up. Na umeshusha mikono. And you took that. Umesimama na mikono imeshuka. And your hands are. Na mali imepiga magoti mbele yako. And treasures. Na wewe ndio unai control. You and you are controlled. Sio yeye ku control. No need to control you. Wengi wamepiga magoti. Most are Wameinua mikono. They have surrendered. Mbele ya mali. Before wealth. Mbele ya vyeo. Before titles. Mbele ya utajiri. Before riches. Mbele ya kazi. Before jobs. Kazi jobs imesimama. Is standing up. Wewe umepiga magoti. You are kneeling down. Mali imesimama. Wealth is standing Watu wengi wamepiga magoti. Most people have this. Na mali nawaamlia. And wealth is standing up. Kwamba leo siji kwako. That I'm not coming to leo you. Leo siji. I am not coming. Unitafute mpaka kutoe jasho. Look for me until you Leo siji kwako. Today I'm not coming. Leo siji mikononi mwako. Today I'm not coming to you. Lakini nimekuja kusema. But I've come to say. Baada ya upako wa leo. After today's and not. Na ukielewa nitakaza kufundisha. And when you understand what I will do. Wewe ndio utaamua. You will be the one to decide. Kwamba wewe njoo na wewe usije. That you come and you don't come. Wewe njoo na wewe usije. You come and you don't come. Listen. Oh, let me give an example of two people. Another soldier, please come. Kneel down. And you stand in front of him. Raise your hand. This is treasure. This is wealth. This is prosperity. This is prosperity. This is title. And this is human. Is kneeling is raising his hand. I have surrendered before wealth. And wealth. Ndio inamwambia. Is what tells him. Ndio inampa pressure. Is what pressurizes. Leo nataka ukitoka hapa. Utakuwa na pressure na mali. You won't have pressure over you. Mali itakuwa na pressure na wewe. Pressure over you. Mm. Kwa ufunuo huu. And the Lord have given me this. Lazima mali ichuke chini. Wealth Amen. has to go down. Lazima wewe uinuke juu. And you Amen. have to raise up. Yes. Kuna kitu There is something. Kuna shida kwenye moyo. There is a problem in the heart. Ambao kitatua. That if you solve it. Mali lazima ikutumikie. Wealth will 